Welcome to the Real Estate Way to Wealth and Freedom podcast with Jacob Ayers, providing actionable content to help you along your journey to financial freedom through real estate investing. As the premier asset class, real estate has helped ordinary people just like you amass fortunes. The benefits of passive income from real estate investing will allow you to live a life you want. And now your host, entrepreneur, real estate investor, and apartment deal syndicator, Jacob Ayers. Hi, and welcome to the Real Estate Way to Wealth and Freedom podcast, episode 57. You're listening to Friday Fundamentals with your host, Jacob Ayers. First, I want to give a couple shout outs to some five-star reviews. Our first five-star review from NRM2492 says, looking back to my earlier years, I wish I had this information a long time ago. Had I been able to listen to a podcast like this, I may have been equipped with the knowledge I needed to successfully invest in the real estate market. If you are already in this market or looking to get into it, definitely check out this podcast. Another five-star review by Wooljin says, this podcast is not overly long and has a lot of great content. Great questions are discussed. Thanks. Thank you all for the great reviews. I'm glad you're getting value out of this show. Every week I ask you as the audience to leave a rating and review if you're getting value from this show. By leaving a rating and review, it helps the show reach more people, which in turn gives me more feedback so I can make the show that much better. So please, if you haven't yet, when you get a chance, go over and leave a rating and review on whichever platform you're listening on. Now with listeners from over 25 different nations, I bring to you this week's episode of Friday Fundamentals. This week's Friday Fundamental is limiting beliefs. Our lives are made up of countless experiences. Our mind processes each of these experiences and then creates a story around that particular experience, either positive or negative. This story is what sticks with us and becomes a belief. Negative experiences often lead to negative stories. Negative experiences often lead to negative stories, while positive experiences lead to positive stories. It's here we want to focus on changing our perception of our experiences. Charles Swindoll famously said, life is 10% what happens to you and 90% how you react to it. We can learn to react positively to our experiences. Let's face it, we all have limiting beliefs, whether those are self-doubts of our physical or mental attributes, lack of confidence, comparison to others, or anything else that causes us to doubt ourselves. If you can learn to overcome these limiting beliefs and search for the positive aspects of your experiences, then you'll be much more prepared for success. Here are some common limiting beliefs real estate investors have, especially starting out. I don't have any experience or background in real estate investing. I don't have time or money to invest. I don't even know where to start. Each of these limiting beliefs can be overcome with simply the right mindset. Here are some positive perspectives you can take with each of these limiting beliefs. I don't have any experience or background in real estate investing. Well, no one was born with a real estate investing background. You, like anyone else, can learn how to invest in real estate. I don't have time or money to invest. This is a common misconception. Most of the time, you only need one or the other, not necessarily both. You can buy rental property for a fraction of the value with a down payment and using other people's money for the rest. No time? No problem. There are many ways to use other people's time, like property managers, turnkey providers, or investing passively in deals. I don't even know where to start. Well, start where you feel comfortable. Learn what interests you. If you like math and have an analytical mind, learn about the finance side of real estate investing. If you like building systems and processes, learn about property management. Take the first step and you'll soon find yourself along the path that fits you best. For every limiting belief, there's a positive story you can tell yourself that will trick your mind into turning that limiting belief into an empowering belief. Think of a limiting belief like a ball and chain on your ankle, dragging you down. Being aware of limiting beliefs and approaching them with a positive, can-do mindset will be like cutting that ball and chain free. Don't get dragged down by your own limiting beliefs. Don't let you be in the way of your own success. 
Practice creating positive stories around every limiting belief and negative experience you have. Soon enough, all the reasons that used to hold you back or make you second guess yourself will be reasons why you should take action. You have every right to an unlimited future. You just have to realize it first. Focus on a positive mindset, unlimited future, and massive levels of success. That wraps up this week's episode of Friday Fundamentals. I hope you're getting value from these short segments every week. Let me know what you think about the format. If you have any questions or comments or want to reach out to me, please do so. You can contact me at www.jacobairs.com forward slash contact or connect with me on Facebook at The Real Estate Way to Wealth and Freedom. Till next week, signing off, I'm your host, Jacob Ayers. You've been listening to the Real Estate Way to Wealth and Freedom podcast, providing you actionable content to build your real estate empire. Nothing on this show should be considered specific, personal, or professional advice. Please consult an appropriate tax, legal, real estate, financial, or business professional for personal advice. The opinions of guests are their own. Information is not guaranteed. All investment strategies have a potential for profit or loss. The host is operating on behalf of the Real Estate Way to Wealth and Freedom, LLC, exclusively.